What's going on guys, it's J-Ho bringing you a brand new video and today I'm going to show you guys my Nightfall and Weekly Crucible rewards from this past week on all three of my characters. This week's Nightfall was the Fallen Saber Strike, not too difficult even though some of the modifiers were pretty tough on this week's Nightfall. But anyways, before I get into the video, sorry I haven't been uploading too much lately. Destiny's been a little bit dry recently due to the lack of new content. However, I'm not going to stop. I'm going to continue playing the game. I still enjoy Crucible and Trials. I still enjoy doing Nightfalls and Raids to earn some new loot with my friends. And it's all still really fun. I'm going to continue to do the activities on a weekly basis like I've been doing even though there hasn't been new stuff in quite a while. So with this latest weekly update, at least we know some stuff coming in the upcoming weeks. Uh, we got Iron Banner this week with Rift for Iron Banner, which is pretty interesting in my opinion. And then we also got the Crimson Days event for Valentine's Day coming in February as well. So with that, we got some new stuff in the upcoming weeks and hopefully we find out more stuff in the future as well. So with that, let's get into my rewards for the video. Starting off with my Nightfall rewards for my first character on my Warlock, we ended up getting ourselves just 11 three of coins and my two teammates ended up getting some legendaries. So pretty rough start on that first Nightfall. Moving on to my next character on my Hunter, we ended up getting ourselves a Legendary this time and we got a Ghost Shell and my two teammates got some Strange Coins and a Class Item. So Strange Coins was probably the best drop on that one. And then for my last Nightfall of the week on my Titan, this time we ended up getting ourselves an Exotic and we got the Dragon's Breath Exotic Rocket Launcher and my teammates got a Custom Horn Kit and 10 three of coins so not bad at least we got one exotic out of those three and then moving on to my crucible rewards of the week for my first character we ended up getting a competitive ghost shell and I've actually been pretty lucky in the past couple weeks because I haven't seen a competitive ghost shell for my rewards in a while but I finally got one once again and then moving on to my next character on my Titan, we ended up getting a Party Crasher plus one a shotgun at 300 attack and the perks on it were actually really good so I ended up getting a range finder on it with reinforced barrel down the middle and the last perk was underdog I believe. So not bad, I actually haven't gotten a range finder Party Crasher up until this drop so that was actually a really lucky drop, I'm definitely going to keep this one and try it out. And then finally for my last crucible drop of the week we ended up getting the nothing manacles exotic gauntlets for the hunter with intellect and discipline and increased grenade throw distance with pulse rifle reload on it so pretty good perks on this nothing manacles and I actually didn't have nothing manacles until this drop so that was really good and that's about it for this video pretty good stuff for this week of rewards we got a good party crasher with rangefinder we got a couple exotics so I'm looking forward to Iron Banner this week and getting some new drops and new loot from that as well. And also looking forward to the new Valentine's Day event Crimson Days coming in a couple weeks after that as well. I can't wait to try it out and see what rewards are in store for that as well. And hopefully we get more news in the future. I know there's a lot of controversy going around in the game right now of Destiny and the fact that Bungie's been silent for a while and how we don't have a roadmap, and all these rumors about Destiny 2 being postponed and stuff like that as well. So hopefully we learn more about that and hopefully it gets better because I still love this game. I know a lot of us do and I hope we have stuff to look forward to. So that's about it. Once again, I'll catch you guys in the next one and I'll talk to you guys later. Peace!